What's up DM citizens? Welcome back to another Ragnarok Origin Guide. In this video, I'll show you all the things to know about Sage and Professor Class. Note that some of the description that I'll be showing may change when it releases in global server, so take it with a grain of salt. I will be covering the skills, weapons, their scores, sigil, and the possible builds. So, let's start! For the Sage class, here are the skills. Advanced Book increases your magic attack, attack speed, and change your normal attack into range and deals 200% magic damage. Dragonology increases your int, mdef, and deals additional damage to dragon monsters. Double Casting Activate double casting whenever you use both skills. Free Cast you can now move while casting skills, but it lowers your movement speed. Spiderweb shoots a spiderweb that damage and immobilizing them and takes double damage when receiving fire damage for the first time. Void Ball similar with element balls, but forced neutral and damage scales based on your SP. Mana Shield Percentage of magic damage received converts to SP reduction, similar with energy code. Drain magic, increased max SP and recovering max SP every 5 seconds. Volcano, create a fire domain that increases fire damage and burn enemies inside the domain. Deluge. Create a water domain that increases water damage and slow enemies inside the domain. Violent Gale Create a wind domain that increases wind damage and blind enemies inside the domain. Create Elemental Converter Allows you to craft elemental converters. Earth Spike Cast a single target earth elemental skill. Heaven's Drive, cast an AOE Earth Element skill. Next are the Professor skills. Auto Spell, an active buff skill that has a chance to automatically cast elemental bolts when using normal attacks. Chant Mastery, a passive skill that increases the chance of auto spell element that doesn't trigger. Element Insight, Dealing magic damage increases your elemental damage that stacks up to 4 times. Mind Breaker increases your magic damage and reduces your target's magic defense when dealing magic damage. Indulge Sacrifice your HP to recover SP. Soul Change Transfer a percentage of your SP to the targeted ally and drain SP if it's an enemy. Soul Burn, a single target skill that deals damage, drain SP, and increase its damage based on target's max HP. Spell Breaker, a single target skill that interrupts a caster and increases their casting time. Dispel, a single target skill that removes the buffs on an enemy. Earthfield, Create an Earth Domain that disable players to cast AoE skills inside. Psychic Wave A neutral AoE skill that deals massive damage up to 10 enemies for 5 seconds. Next are the Weapons. Elemental Origin Elemental Source Magic Book Tell of Wisdom Ancient Magic Principles of Magic Ledger of Death Dragon Legacy 
and prophecy. Next are the Verus Course, Transcendence, Triple Throne, Disturbing Domain, Power of the Stars, Element Gloves, Prophetic Spell, Mind Name, Firebolt Boost, Cold Bolt Boost, Lightning Boost, Psychokinesis Boost and Energy Acceleration Next is the Sigil The only Sigil for Sage is Chaos Energy Last are the possible builds for Sage There are 3 builds for Sage Auto Spell Elemental Caster and Neutral Caster for auto spell, this build is focused more on normal attacks and maximizing their attack speed to trigger the elemental bolts similar to magic crusher build for wizard. For elemental caster, this build is focused on casting elemental bolts and using the element advantage to deal massive damage to the enemy. And last is the neutral caster. This build is focused on using the Skill Void Bolt, Soul Burn, and Psychic Wave to deal neutral damage to enemies. And that is the end of our video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and press the bell notification button for more guides like this. If you have questions, just put it on the comment section below and as always, thank you for watching. Bye-bye!